G'day, g'day. Welcome to Wicked Wildlife. My name's Nick and this guy here is Spyro, one of our male frill neck lizards. Now, we're going to tackle a bit of a topic that to reptile people might seem a bit unusual. But whenever I take Spyro here out on display, uh, out here in southwest Victoria, I have locals come up and tell me that they've seen frill neck lizards in their backyards or out camping. Now, whether or not it's true, we'll have to have a bit of a talk about. So stay tuned, guys. We're talking about lizards. So, like I said, anybody who's particularly interested in reptiles will probably find it a bit of a strange topic that uh, Victorians swear to God they see frill neck lizards like Spyro. You see, frill neck lizards like Spyro and Lady, our female at home, uh, they're found across northern Australia, up in the Northern Territory, Kimberley Country, North Queensland, and they push down to a southeast Queensland in some places. However, Victoria is a long, long way from even southeast Queensland. So if they're not seeing frill neck lizards, and they swear black and blue that they are, what is it they're seeing? So if frill neck dragons like Sparrow here are limited to North Queensland, the Northern Territory, the Kimberley, down to southeast Queensland, what are people seeing here in Victoria or New South Wales? That would be something like this guy. This is Gizmo. Now Gizmo here is a central bearded dragon. We've actually got two species of bearded dragons here in Victoria. Uh, down where I am, we've got the eastern bearded dragon, Pagona babata, and uh, he's found all the way along the Great Dividing Range up into sort of central Queensland like Roma. And uh, when you go further inland, when you get to the red soil country, you get the central beardy, like Gizmo here. Now, how could you mistake this guy for a frill neck lizard? Gizmo here doesn't frill up for anybody. He does kids parties for a living, he's seen it all. But if you do come across a bearded dragon and you give him a bit of a fright, he sticks his beard out. Big sort of spiky ring under his chin, looks like a pirate's beard, covered with spikes. So it does sort of, I guess, frill up. But when you see him side by side, you can see they're definitely different animals. They are, of course, both dragons, those big triangular shaped heads, but very different parts of the country and uh, totally different attitudes, not all that closely related at all. If anything, I guess it goes to show why we use scientific names. You see down here, people call this a frill neck, up north people call this a frill neck, but uh, when we use their Latin names, they've got very different ones. So we all know that everybody's talking about the same thing. So there you go. No real frill neck lizards down here in Victoria, even if we've got lizards that can frill up a little bit. Now, I hope you enjoy the video. Please hit that subscribe button down below or check us out on Facebook, Wicked Wildlife. We're bringing videos out every Monday, Wednesday and Friday for the rest of the year. So uh, stick around guys, check back next time. Have a good one and take care.